Talking about Atlanta, bro. How's that trip for you? Horrible. Genuinely. Didn't like it. <clears throat> Don't like Atlanta? Nope. Wow. Atlanta will never see me again. And I, and I think I know the reason, but I'm, I'm And the only reason I will go Atlanta is to go and see the boys. Yeah. But the reason, Other than you, that, the reason you didn't like it? Yeah, WAPS everywhere. What? So like, what's, what's WAPS? WAPS is guns. Obviously, right. Um, I'm a bit different to the boys. I like partying. I like going out. So a lot of the time, I say a lot of the time, every night I went out. But yeah, it was just mad uneasy. I gave it loads of chances and I just didn't enjoy it. Guys are walking in with Glocks in their back pockets. Like, bro. Uncomfortable. And it just makes you more uneasy because I'm not from there. It was, it'd be different if I grew up in that environment and I got my little switcher on me as well. Then, yo, let's go if it goes off. Do you get what I'm saying? But I'm in there as a tourist. There's these guys all in there smoking weed, hot, their faces looking like that. Like, I remember one guy, he was looking at, uh, for the audio listeners, I'm doing a face. One guy was looking at me like that. I went like that. You know, like when you're just looking around in the a, in a shops and then you kind of look at someone because you can tell they look a bit mad. Mm. So I'm watching him like that. But then he's clocked that I'm watching him. So he just looks at me like Still that. Mate, yeah. At that point, I left. So basically, um, in the southern states like Georgia, they have open carry. So you're just allowed to hold your gun and be outside and it's absolutely fine. So that's what's a bit wild about these kind of southern places. But that, to them, it's not the wild. Have the problem. They're the ones that have that's the problem with the gun controls every time they mention gun control in America. It's the southern states. They're like, no, 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 we want, we want our guns. You know what I mean? So, yeah, that was it. Was a it was a worry down there because I saw maybe about fifteen guns in the space of five days. Even down to like, we're filming content, yeah. You know the director, the producer, the sound man. Everyone's got a gun on them, innit? Yeah. What? Yeah, no, 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 no. Crazy. But it's well, like not casually. Yeah, yeah casually, like, casually. but it's not mad. Like they're not holding it to make them feel <laughs> like what waist. I'm the man. Like I'll grease you off. Nah. Like I'm asking a guy in a casual conversation, right? Everyone's got a gun out here, innit? And he's going, yeah, I got mine on me right now. Wow. Like, they, every, yeah. see, yeah. alive, bro? I'm yeah, not making yeah, this yeah, up, yeah. you know. The production team have WAPs. So you could be sitting there right now, but your WAPs just in your, in your waist, just booling. I don't know if I could live like that. Very, no, but on the edge. I think we say that because it's not our normality. For them, they're not shocked or they're not... Everyone's got a gun, bro. Yeah, but there, there is a reason to be shocked because of how often gun uh, crimes oh. happen, bro. So yeah, I, would, I don't, I don't, I, I don't, I don't know statistics. I, I've got. I literally was reading up on it yesterday. Funny enough, and there was a killing uh, yesterday in uh, I think one of the states. I'm not gonna name it. One of the states just yesterday, and there was three people that died. You know what I mean? It's so f common and so regular. Like it just in March there was about 15, 16 incidents. Yeah. Like it was too often. It's too. It happens too much, That's and it's much. because of the fact that they just give away these guns to random people without even checking their their psych, seeing if they're. You know what I mean? How about this? I was in LA. I think it was LA or one of these places anyway. And we went to go shoot gun range. Gun range, yeah. They didn't ask about if we were mentally stable. They didn't do no tests. They just made us sign something. Going downstairs. Yeah, well, you bam, could, have, bam, easy, bam, you could bam. have easily turned around and I shot I could have just turned it and yeah. just let it off on everyone. You know what mm. I mean? So I remember when I checked how easy it was to sign up for it. And then when I'm downstairs, I'm shooting, but I'm doing this. I'm looking left and right as I'm yeah. shooting because I'm seeing there's a row of six people. And obviously everyone was white at the time and there's just hella black people there. So in my head, I'm paranoid already because I'm already paranoid about America. You know, so I'm, I'm shooting that. like this. I'm looking left and right as I'm, I'm don't, moving. Do, don't do that. Oh. You ain't a booter like that, though. Well, it's, it's normal. And you weren't looking left, right. Well, I didn't know. No, Wallah, I didn't know. that's crazy. Well, I got You're a not video. seeing that. That I means got... the kickback's not even phasing it. That's lying. <laughs> Really? <laughs> he's moving like he's really from North not West, you know. Yeah, eating down the place. No more, no more, no more. To be fair though, the big WAPs have no kickbacks. So for example, the AR-15, it was light. It was going beep, beep, beep. But the Desert Eagle, game. Yeah. I said, shotgun, yeah. shotgun. You know your shoulder. Yeah, yeah. Salam alaikum wa rahmatullah wa barakatuh. That one, it really well, he says salam. Yeah, that one was very dangerous. I can't lie to you. But America, Atlanta, I could tell that. Um, I'm giving America Philly, to. Philly wasn't a big fan of him. Yeah, man. LA, I didn't really like either. Really? <laughs> yeah, I died when he went. Yeah. Oh, I knew that was forced. Yeah. Why? No, well, it wasn't. I really wanted to go rolling loud and see some friends that I've. I love making friends. That's oh. my thing. Okay. Uh, and I recently made these new friends and I wanted to go spend time with them. Um, so I went, but I didn't enjoy my time. What's it like being. And in... I blame my boy. My boy wasn't a good host. Yeah, you need a good host in LA. He wasn't a good host, bro. Like, you got to remember. You don't know him, you know? Oh, okay. But the reason I went is to go see them. Good. I only saw them at that Rolling Loud Fest. You didn't recommend me no spots to eat. We didn't oh. go out together. I'm I'm thankful to God, Big Zoo, AJ Tracy, H. Tyreek. 
Tyreek was there. He had his friend Rico. If it weren't for them, I would have had the worst time ever. Wild. But yeah, I actually need to text him about that. He'd done a bad job. I text his other friend and I was like, bro, when you come to London, I'll show you what hosting is. Americans are usually very hospitable. No, nah, mm. they weren't. Right? But he's hot mm. of his face all the time. What well, he does is smoke. Oh, okay. Yeah. What's it like being in, uh, in one of Kai's streams? Sick. It feel, you know when I saw you in it? That was <laughs> weird. <laughs> like, seeing Chunks so in the weird. background, I was like, it's like when you're playing a computer game. I was like, is that what? Yeah, it was sick uh, still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know well, what I mean? Yeah, no, it was, it, was a, it was a surreal experience. Obviously, been a fan of Kai for some while now, since COVID, of course. So I've always wanted to be on his streams. Managed to have a segment about like the magician playing a little trick with me. Uh, and then Kai told me from the beginning he wanted me to be in that. So me and um, Phils were in Atlanta and uh, he just popped up with us and said, yo, you guys are here. I'm doing a 12-hour uh, stream with Drewski. Can I have um, Philly for the dating segment? And then can I have you for the the magician segment? Hilarious yeah, cool. stream, though. So we came down and it was, it was fun, man. Hilarious, Sick. hilarious It's stream. weird. You were like, because your bit sort of went viral, didn't it? With the... Yeah, all my bits like, tend to go around. Like, no, no, I did, yeah. No, nah, it went very well because of uh, he had a, it was a funny date that he was on. And I think he was the first one. He was the first to go on a date. Yeah. That I day. can't lie. When it comes to dating content, I'm one of the goats, man. Could you date him? Do you think American No one might girls? say it, but I'm telling I you. I think that it was very different. I saw a tweet um, saying that UK and US band is very different. Yeah. And I feel like it looked like me and Philly were out of our depths in that room. But for me, my reason for that... Did it, not, yeah? Yeah, it did. It I did. Don't, I don't, but when I watched it back, me, yeah. I, didn't, I didn't feel like that. I feel like... He's loving I, you guys. No, no, yeah. I feel like from my point of view, they were laughing at our, our accent. They weren't laughing at our jokes. Interesting. That, that's the... Do you think they, they could understand jokes? you? Huh? Do you think they could understand you? Yeah, they did. But, but what they would do, for example, would say something and they'll just laugh and re-say how we said it in our accent. You get it? Yeah. But right. I feel like for me, the reason that I was more tame was because of the fact that it was a Drewski and Kai stream. So there's no point of doing main character syndrome when it's not about you. You know that is a good say. point. Yeah, it's like you can't. Well, it kind of was though, because he's invited you. I get you, so but how's then it? the title is Drewski Kai. So if it was like yeah, Kai Drewski Chunks Philly, then it's, I'm part of this show, so I can do what I want. That but is the, one of the most likable qualities about you, I think. 